As expected, Governor Ron DeSantis has entered the 2024 presidential race. In doing so, he steps into a uh, crowded Republican primary contest that is still growing. That will test his national appeal and the GOP party's willingness to move from one former president, Donald Trump. DeSantis revealed his decision in a Federal Election Commission filing before an online conversation with Twitter CEO Elon Musk that began moments ago today. Political Director Dave Price joins us now. And Dave, unlike Governor DeSantis, former Vice President Mike Pence hasn't announced his plans, uh, plans yet. And is there any clue as to when he will? We are still waiting. He has said that candidates would need to decide in June, so we know that it's getting close to June here. Now, Pence is now perhaps the most well-known Republican who has not said yet what he wants to do in 2024. He has to figure out, is there some realistic path where he could actually defeat Donald Trump and the rest of the Republican field in 2024? He spent part of his day today before students at Des Moines Christian. Pence shared how he says his faith guides his political decisions. You're constantly making choices. You're constantly making decisions. And so I, I hope, I, I hope uh, my faith has, has granted me a modicum of wisdom to be able to make good decisions along the way. Pence shared with the students a story that he's told before in Iowa that he really found his faith when he was in college after he says he drifted away from it earlier in his youth. He also talked about the role Christianity played with the Founding Fathers, and he told students about the threats he says that Christianity faces these days. And the truth is, we live in a time today when, in many ways, um, Christian values are under assault. Not here at Des Moines Christian School, but in, in many corners in your generation. He did not say specifically how or which Christian values he believes are under assault. Now, he did have something in common today with an already declared presidential candidate, that's South Carolina Senator Tim Scott. They both held political events today at a Christian school. Pence had that one at Des Moines Christian, while Scott held an event at Siouxland Christian School in Sioux City today, underscoring the importance of faith as this Republican field starts to take shape for 2024.